We're at Zam Swamp Tour. Check it out some of the natural entertainment that Lafouche Parish has to offer. And this has been in business for over 50 years. In fact, that's the original building over there. They used to be fur merchants before it morphed into a swamp tour. And actually, the fun starts before you even get on the boat. So let's check it out. He's got some serious teeth. You know why they're orange? Why? You don't brush them. <laughs> All right, you can pet him. He's, he's be all right. He just wanted a cookie. He's a really soft compared to what a lot of people think. They don't have coarse hair. They have actually hair like us. ZZ, Zamariah Zane Loop, calls himself the prodigal son. His grandfather and mom started this place, and his dad was also around every step of the way. Now, the key to a good tour is the tour guide, and ZZ's personality is larger than life. So oh if you look real God. good, don't ever do this at home, though, I'm telling you. There's a Cajun fingernail clipper. Heard it? It's not a pop like an alligator would make. <laughs> alligator bit my hand right here. See this score? Three, three teeth went through my hand. These two teeth came out the bottom. <laughs> so you see how alligators lunge? Uh -huh. They're ambush predators. And that's how they catch a lot of deer. I just happen to be aware that he's here. But if you're not aware that he's in that pocket of water and you're a deer and you come to drink, by the time he lunges out and grabs you, your brain doesn't have time to process what happened, let sure. alone get out of the way. I feel like you're still too close to him. I'm all right. I'm a professional. <laughs> like any Cajun, ZZ is resourceful. So I yell, and it sounds like a horn, and the lady in the little bridge house there hears me, and she opens the bridge, and she lets me go through. No. I grew up here, this is my habitat, this is my surroundings, and this swamp tour is, it's like a family member to me. Even though it's not a, a living thing, it's still something that I hold really close to my heart. But he did leave it for a bit. ZZ actually got an opportunity with WWE. He finished second in their 10-week reality show, Tough Enough, and WWE offered him a contract. His stage name, ZZ King of the Bayou. When I got there, instead of me coming up with this personality that I am, I was already the personality. I'm a fun-loving guy from Louisiana that loves to cook and I wrestle alligators for fun. Listen, <laughs> I'm multilingual. I speak English, Cajun, French, and alligator. ZZ finds out what people are interested in, what makes them tick, and uses that information to tailor his tour, which he calls uncommercialized. He wants people to enjoy themselves and knows for some the tour is an escape from reality. You go on vacation, you come to Louisiana, you come on my swamp tour and I say, hey, look, you see that turtle? You know why his shell's so shiny? And you say, no, why? And I say, turtle wax. And it's funny. <laughs> and for that one second, you forget that your grass is growing four feet at your house or you got an overdue electric bill and about to shut it off. Watch, give me your pin. Oh, sure, okay. Ready? Uh-huh. Zams has been hit hard by the pandemic. ZZ is also a nuisance warden for the Louisiana Department of Fisheries, and he's taken on more hours as a boat captain just to make ends meet. So we always talk about support your local businesses. Now that's more important than ever. And trust me, this is definitely worth the experience. ZZ promises two hours of memories, and he definitely delivers. In Bayou Buff, Leslie Spoon, Eyewitness News.